In this problem, we're told that a circle is cut into 103 wedges, like super small slices in a pizza. The first 90 wedges are cut equally and cut together are, are together are supplementary. Supplementary means 180 degrees. So you can picture if we cut the pie in half, right, and rearrange those wedges, right, they will take up half of, of the, the circle. Right, I'm not going to draw all these slices, but you can imagine here that the first 90 fill up the 180 degrees, and they're all cut equally, so they're all the same size here. So we could find out the size of these wedges by basically dividing, right? 180 degrees divided by the 90 that are there. That's 2 degrees per wedge because they're cut evenly. You can't divide um, by 90 here unless they are all cut equally. Division does cut things equally, so we can divide to figure out how this is set up. They say then that the next um, five wedges are cut equally and together are complementary. So these next five pieces are larger and they take up 90 degrees. Complementary is, of course, 90 degrees. So here we know in, in this section, right, we have one, two, three, four, five pieces. One, two, three, four, five. Now my diagram here is terrible. I'm sorry about that because these five pieces should be equal in, in angle measure. But the point is that we can now divide 90 degrees by 5 to figure out the size of these pieces, right? Nine, uh, 5 goes into 120 times, and so it goes into 90, 18 times. So each of these um, slices are 18 degrees, right? What is the angle measure of the final 8 wedges? Well, the final 8 wedges must fill the remaining space here, right? Those 8 wedges, let me get a different color, right, take up this portion of the pie, the last 90 degrees. So they're also complementary. So it's 90 degrees cut into 8 pieces, right? How big is that? Well, 8 goes into 90, right? 8 goes into 8 10 times, so it goes into 90 11 times with a remainder of 2. So it's 11 and 2 eighths, or it's 11 and 1 fourth, or 11.25 degrees. So each of these wedges are 11.25 degrees. Thank you.